I made something for you. It's uh, actually uh, the most industrial candle I've ever made. So believe it or not, this is a candle. Um, it's burning fairly intensely for what most people consider a candle, but this is how the ancients did it. See, I have the ancient knowledge. It's because I'm an old pro. Or is it the other way around? Anyway, point is that uh, the materials that are burning here are in uh, have been basically soaked in essential oils and then mixed with some other oils that smell good when burned. Um, and thus we have the wicking effect. Okay, that's what makes a candle a candle is the wicking effect. Um, so, uh, bacon fat was the primary uh, thing, though. We didn't use paraffin or petroleum. They didn't have that. Nobody, nobody had, nobody had paraffin wax. Okay, that's that's the modern poison stuff. Okay, that stuff's uh, and soy. No, they didn't use soy. No, they used animal fat, like mammoth. There's mammoths, mastodons. You know, stuff like that. You just, you got a lot of candles out of those bastards in addition to the meat. So that's why candles always smelled like cooking, basically, like canola oil or baking cooking. Um, in addition to other things that was added to spice it up. And then there we have it. So here's our, our candle halabra here, a little three quarters uh, thick steel plate on a grate on a, on a steel case uh, good old boy yeah it's a nice candle this candle has wheels on it so you can move your candle around now they did not have this back in the day Oh no, it's been two minutes, 38 seconds. This is how long my five subscribers pay attention for. All right, guys, have a nice day.